Hello, you are welcome. How to solve this problem? Square root of 5 root 5. Then inside the root, we have root 5 again. Equals to 125 raised to the power x. From here, we can square both sides. So we have square root of 5 root 5. Then root 5. All square here. Then equals to 125 raised to the power x squared. So we square both sides from here. And uh, this square here we affect the first square root to cancel each other. And this will become 5 root 5. Then root 5. Here it will become 2. We multiply x here. So it's 125 raised to the power 2x from here and also in the next step we can also square both sides so when we square this side we have everything square and then we square this side as well then this square we affect 5 and this square root so and the 5 square here we have 25 then multiply by square we cancel this square root that will remain 5 root 5 then equals to also from here this power we multiply each other and we have 125 raised to the power of 4x then in the next step we can multiply this 25 times 5 that will give us 125 then root 5 equals to 125 raised to the power of 4x and uh, in the next step, let's divide both sides by 125. So divide this side as well by 125. 125 comes to each other here. And uh, we are left with root 5. Root 5 now equals to. On this side, we can rewrite this from the law of indices when we have a raised to power m divided by a raised to power m. This can be written as a raised to power m minus n. So when we subtract this power from here, this is 25 raised to power 1, and this will be 125 raised to power 4x minus 1. And uh, in the next step, let's take the square on both sides again. We square this side, and also we square this side. Square, we cancel square root, and we have 5 left here. So we have 5 equals to. Here, this power we multiply each other. And we have 125. Then raised to power 2 multiplied by 4x minus 1. Then same thing as writing it as. 5 equals to 125 raised to power 8x minus 2 when to open the bracket and uh, equally we can write 125 to base 5 and this will be 5 raised to power 1 equals to 5 raised to power 3 that's 125 then multiply by 8x minus 2 then when it when 3 open this bracket here we have 5 raised to power 1 will be equals to 5 raised to power 24x then minus 6 so we have same base now we can equate the power and that means this power is equal to this one so we can write say we have 24x minus 6 is equal to 1 and taking minus 6 they're becoming plus and from here we have 24x equals to 1 plus 6 then 24x equals to 7 then we can divide both side by 24 from here then we have 24 cancel 24 so from here we can say that x is equals to 7 over 24 and here we have the value of x we can check using the equation given to confirm if this satisfies the problem thank you for watching don't forget this step don't miss out subscribe to my channel and also turn the notification bell on see you in the next class and bye for now